For decades, the State Historical Society and the National Guard tossed around the idea of building a military museum. And in 2022, the two organizations signed a formal agreement. Elizabeth Shores tells us what you can expect to see in the Heritage Center's planned addition. If you like the conflict and war section in the North Dakota Heritage Center's Yesterday and Today exhibit, you're in luck. The National Guard is partnering with the Historical Society to build a new addition to the Heritage Center to house a new military museum. So inspirational stories of North Dakotans in the military are, are everywhere, where are just one example after another of North Dakotans going above and beyond what was expected to, to accomplish great things and then not telling too many people about it. Historical Society Director Dr. Bill Peterson says when talks of a new museum began all those years ago, it was because the National Guard was interested in preserving its North Dakota history. Over time, the original idea for a standalone National Guard museum expanded to be an addition to the Heritage Center that includes all branches of the military. We could want this uh, really, really bad. But without the partnership of the Historical Society and Dr. Bill Peterson, we would never be able to pull this off. So it really is a team effort. Great support from the governor's office, great support from the legislature. Dr. Peterson says the goal is to share those stories with the public. He says they hope to start building in 2025 and to open to the public sometime in 2029. In Bismarck, I'm Elizabeth Shores, reporting for Your News Leader. Major General Dorman says the museum will cost around $60 million.